Welcome to the real world example video. We're going to um, do an example of using Pulsar to move stock data. So one thing I changed was uh, broker duplication to be true. This is in the broker comp file. That basically just means if a, a broker receives the same exact message, including message ID twice, then the message will not be transmitted multiple times. It's uh, it's part it's it's on the way towards effectively once messaging. So I'm going to um, verify that Pulsar is running. Looks like we're good. It's good to see info messages. If you see error messages, that's a that's a clear indicator that something's wrong. Okay, so I'm running Jupyter Notebook, and I have a few um, consumers running. You can just copy and paste this code if you want. Um, but for now, we're going to go ahead and create the tenants. So Pulsar Training dash tenant one, create the namespace within Pulsar Training dash tenant one. Finally, we're going to create a partitioned topic. We're going to go with a partition topic just because that's the most common thing I see. Generally, um, generally we want to have some sort of uh, parallelization of tasks, and partitions give us that. Okay, so this is the uh, consumer. Starting all three consumers. Okay. Now the consumer type is key shared, um, so we're going to have messages use keys, and the keys are going to be the stock ticker symbol. So each consumer receives the same ticker. Okay. So Y Finance is a great tool too; it's very easy to use. Very simple. So basically, uh, Y Finance is going to go out and pull each of those um, tickers from that list and then send them through to the, to the broker. See, this is uh, the consumers have received the messages. It's the output. We're going to run it again. Cool. So we, what we want to see here is that consumers are receiving the same, um, same stock tickers. So that's part of the, that's the key part. So, we'll, um, just to prevent, you know, maybe round robin from messing, we'll add in, um, a few new ones. Walmart and Tesla seem good. Okay, run that again. Now we can see A, B, and D is still coming to the to the same consumer. A, B, B, V is going to the same consumer. A, B, and D. Consumer one happens to be getting Walmart as well, which is a new one. And consumer three. Consumer three just got Tesla. So if we run again, those same consumers should be getting Tesla in Walmart. Perfect. Feel free to use this code for your own projects. And now you know how to set up Pulsar and get using it.